do it. Let me do it. Our mail is way down there. <laughs> we gotta walk uphill in the snow both ways. Here we go. So I know it's been a while and we will get to that. Today though, I wanna open a package with you guys that I've been waiting for for over a year. My fiance ordered it for my birthday last year and contained within this package is over 100 pieces of artwork from my favorite artist here on YouTube. And I'm so freaking excited to finally see each and every piece. This came in a super convenient time too because it's been about a year since I've been able to properly make any artwork myself and I'm in desperate need of some inspiration. So let's see what we got. Almost there. Does anybody else need to walk through a cornfield to get to your mailbox? Or is this just a weird thing that I got to do? Let me know. I just want to shout out our mail crew real fast for every single day leaving treats in here. For this bad guy? Super cool. We have the package and it's cold. I really should have wore socks. That would have been a super cool thing to do. <sighs> oh guys, I'm so excited. Oh, I'm a little worried I might freeze to death before I get home. This is perfect. Snowball snow. Look at that. Look at... Where'd it go? All right, we're about there. Traveling through the forest, over rivers, through fields to get this art. <laughs> All right, here we are. It's finally here. My favorite artist on YouTube is Ten Hundred. Ten Hundred is an artist, designer, muralist, videographer entrepreneur, and just a super fun creator to follow. And if you guys are into my humble art and videos, I know you would love his library of binge-worthy content. And if you're an artist, there's a lot there you can learn. It's the reason I got an iPad Pro and dove into digital art. It helped me with my first mural, my second, probably my third too when I get to it. I highly recommend checking him out, man. I really do. Um, I love his content. Uh, it's super honest, super upfront about how hard art is sometimes. Like I mentioned, it's been, it's been like a year since I really sat down and, and made any artwork. We've just been focused on the family, but we're getting back. So I'm really excited to open this and kind of just get those creative gears flowing again. I'm literally shaking. I'm shaking right now. I don't even know what to say. 10 hundred art. Dude, I'm so excited. And so yeah, let's get some gloves on. I love his style, but you'll see. Whimsical, dark, it's fun. It's fun to look at. It's fun for the eyes to explore. I love it. So these are two decks of cards. Last year, he did a 10 part series where he made his own custom decks. And he even had um, all kinds of people working on it, people all around the world, and all kinds of places. He had Chris Ramsey on there, giving him tips. I definitely know I don't really even play cards, to be honest. I just really wanted something finally um, from Ten Hunt. So he filmed this whole process, designing these cards, learning how to get them printed correctly. I learned more about cards in those 10 videos than I was even able to retain super massive project and then when it finally hit kickstarter i think his goal was like ten thousand dollars and they hit that in like three minutes insane and then within the first day like almost like two hundred thousand dollars insanity and then by the end of the project i need to get a new blade apparently oh man i saw the colors i'm so excited dude i don't even want to talk about it this anymore i just want to look at them <laughs> but yeah like 1.5 million dollar project on kickstarter Insane. Oh, what is this? Oh, this is some billing stuff. Is that, is that a sticker? I, like, I don't think I got any stickers. Here we go. Let me just show them off. There it is. So this is the Vivid Kingdoms deck. Oh man, look at that. So sick, dude. Holy shit. I believe this deck, I think it's available on a store maybe? Um, and then this. Oh, I did get some stickers. What? Oh, no way. Dude, okay, look at that. That is so sick, dude. I'm so excited. I don't know what I'm gonna put these on. And then this, yeah. And this is the King's Blood deck that I believe was only available during the Kickstarter event. So this one, I don't even know. I have a, like, I don't even know if I wanna open it. Play to win, play for keeps. That's freaking wild. So I wanted to get two decks so I could play with one 
and then have the other just frame all the cards or something. Let's get into this one first. Oh man, I'm nervous. I'm still shaking, dude. I'm so excited. And these card videos were so cool. Just to see how all the designs evolved as he learned. Oh. So cool. Look at that. Premium playing cards, Vivid Kingdoms. Like I said, I'm not really much of a card connoisseur. So my problem was I used to collect Pokemon cards and Yu-Gi-Oh cards and so many sick Digimon cards. I had them all in this single binder, lost them all. So I haven't really I have each of my daughters gave me a, a Pikachu card. <laughs> Got these tiny little bitty mini cards just because I thought they were funny. But that's, that's kind of making me want to collect again. Dude, look at that. That's so sick. Dude, look at that. Look at it. Oh, man. Put the little watcher down there, dude. Oh, like I don't want to break the seal. Yeah, I don't, I don't want to break the seal. I don't, I'm getting a weirdo right now. But still shaking. All right. Oh, there we go. Dude, look at that. It's got like splatter on the bottom. That is so freaking cool. Oh man, I'm so excited just to have some art from Tim Hart. And then look at this, like names on the inside of the box. That's cool. The box is sick. The effort that it had to go into the box, ridiculous. Like, but look at this, this is so cool. With the crown and the watcher. I'm in love with this already, this is sick. Okay, let's see what's sitting on the very bottom. Whoa. <laughs> oh, I actually, I think there was something to do with uh, magic tricks. Super cool, though. And what's... Oh, man. Look at that, dude. But just look at that. Ah, oh, dude, that is so sick. That's sick, dude. Ten on, man. On the ten of hearts. Let's just... Oh, look at this. Look at this freaking ace of spades. It's so sick. It's ridiculous, man. The king. Oh, man. Look at this queen, dude. This queen is sick. I feel like that's half of just all I'm going to be saying right now. But, but look at these, dude. This is, dude. Oh, man. I, I don't know. That card is also in the deck. And that's just, like, I don't know. The freaking ace of of watchers, dude. This is wild, man. And just all the, like, there's so many tiny little, like, do what you like. Dude, this Viking King is sick. This Odin with his ravens and the eye patch. I love that the diamonds are watchers. That's so freaking cool. I was learning all kind of words watching those videos, like pips and indices and stuff. Like, there's just so much that went into the card making. That's just wild. Athena. With the owl, like, oh man. And with the sticker, it's, oh man. This jack, so freaking cool. Oh, and then look at these number cards. This is what I was so excited for, too, because look, all the suits tell like their own little story and they go together. Like the art travels across the cards. I can't even, I don't even understand how this all came together. I watched it, but the amount of work that had to have been happening behind the camera, and then on top of you trying to film all this, and this is crazy. And see like that. Like I couldn't have just imagined just dropping a whole suit in a winning game on somebody. And then just, you know, you've also got this beautiful, like the, the tennis spades, something about like, I don't know, it's got that like, like when you're like 11 years old and you get like a couple pieces of Exodia. Like this, this is that. This feels so freaking cool. Looks like Peter himself, the man 10 hundred, scribbling away, man. Hell yeah. These cards are so sick, dude. This freaking ace, ace of clubs. I love the ace cards, just how much detail is just packed into them, man. Look at the club suits. This is a little haphazard, but I'm, I'm just kind of looking, man. I'm just kind of absorbing all of this. I don't know who out there is excited about this, but I'm, I'm freaking stoked, man. Look at these. Dude, look. It's like the least constructive thing to say. Look. So after a year of patiently waiting, 
This is the 10 hundred Vivid Kingdom playing card deck. And I'm so freaking stoked. You guys need to go subscribe to 10 hundred goals, <laughs> basically. Ah, so yeah, let's open this. Let's open. Let's actually first maybe clear the deck a little bit. Because I'm going to do some smaller shots so you guys can see the art a little bit better. This card is so sick, dude. I don't know what, like, I don't, I don't know. This queen, though, man. This might be one of my favorite cards. Easily top three. Look at it. <laughs> I haven't shuffled a deck in years. <laughs> Actual years. This is definitely my favorite suit. That's too sick, man. do that the first time and I'm so disappointed <laughs> all right here we go so this deck I'm not gonna be playing with I think I'm gonna find a way to frame throw it up in the studio I think would be super freaking cool Boom. dude it just like even the cover box is so nice it's got this sick gold what a cool experience all right I wonder if that says something I used to have this like was the Book of Dragons, and it had some kind of similar, like just old ruins, and then you could translate it to friend secret messages. The teachers would try to get our notes, they'd be like, what in the world is going on? Okay, I think we should just maybe not be weird. We'll just break the seal on this one. I don't really know what I'm doing, to be honest. Too excited. Oh, well, seeing and I would have missed out on the other one. Look at this freaking eyeball, dude. The eyes are so sick. Look at that. It's freaking awesome. Oh, see, and they do look good, though. They do look freaking good, though. And this, you could only get on the Kickstarter. I'm so freaking excited to have these. So, same cards, but they're so sick. And yeah, these, these ones are getting framed, for sure. Boom, what is this? Okay, yeah. Thank you, card. Some stats on how the Kickstarter went. I don't know what number one means. So, I mean, I have the first King's Blood that... I'm not gonna say that, that'd be, that'd be too crazy. <laughs> that'd be too insane, there's no way here. I'd honestly freak out. I didn't imagine just how immediately stressful that must have been, like that's just insane. That's so cool. I do remember there were supposed to be some secret Joker cards. Oh, that is sick, dude, look at that. That's so freaking cute. Little Juniper, that's freaking adorable. The two secret Jokers, way freaking cool. This card reminds me of my little ones. Dude, I'm still shaking. I'm still shaking, can you believe that? I'm still like, I don't even know why I'm wearing gloves necessarily. And then yeah, and then the original, I forgot, how cool. The original King of Hearts design. So if you watch the video series, it was one of the earlier designs. It, it, there was a redesign he did, which looks so freaking sick. The OG does look cool though, and like it's, it's like a rare card now. It's super tight to have. Dude, just look how nice these, like, the backs of these cards look. Like, like, they're just so freaking sick. Pretty much all I've said, but I just wanted to experience this with you guys. It being my favorite art YouTuber. If you guys, again, if you, if you guys don't follow him, there is an immense amount of quality to be found there. And we even got Georgie. This card's tight. And then I guess something I better do now while I feel like I have to since I'm on camera is shuffle the deck, which, like I said earlier, I haven't done that in years, so I'll probably just embarrass myself. First. Hello. I guess let's give these. I'm like trembling, man. Some people do that, like. So I used to shuffle my Pokemon cards. This kind of deal. Oh, man, they feel great. Wow. That's actually super satisfying. Oh, pop the ace, man, on the shuffle. What? Ace of spades after we got the shuffle. Okay. That's cool. Oh.
I hope you have an awesome day, and with it just around the corner, I hope you have a Merry Christmas. See you soon.